Toy fans, welcome to a LEGO review, a LEGO City Arctic review at that. This is the new series from LEGO. This set itself is 60034, ages 6 to 12, and it is the Arctic Helicrane. It will cost $24.99 to purchase. We do get some Husky Dogs included in this, along with minifigures and, of course, the helicopter there. You can see the minifigures and dogs on the top of the box. If we spin through the rear, there are some pictures of the set. But let's open the box and see exactly what is included inside the box first. So here we have the total contents of the box. We get one sticker sheet included and we get two instruction manuals as well. And we have all these bags which do go up to the highest number of three. So three bags of bricks included but let's get this built and see exactly what it looks like so here is the whole set all constructed now we do get two minifigures we get the sled with huskies as well and of course we get the helicopter included but first let's have a look at those minifigures and here is minifigure number one this is the female explorer minifigure so let's bring her in you can see she's wearing orange goggles and we have the front and rear Explorer printing detail. Let's take the hood off, and there you can see the face print, which there is only one of. So, there you go, there is your female Explorer. And our second minifigure is the pilot needed to operate the helicopter. So, it does come with the pilot glasses or pilot sunglasses with the pilot's print on the torso front and rear and we do have this headpiece with a visor we only get that one face print on the head next up we have our sled with the four husky dogs included on the front these are attached to these pieces and they are separate figures on their own these are really cool i love these dogs and we do get four included which do clip onto this long piece which then attaches to the sled. On the front of the sled we do have this camera, a light, there is a place for our minifigurative stand at the rear and there we do have a radar readout in their search for the crystal elements. In the middle we do have this basket piece with um, some tools inside. One of them which I really like is this metal detector. That is very cool. We do get a walkie talk in there and a couple of other useful tools for them to use on their expedition and here we have the largest part of the set of course it is the heli crane and this is kind of like one that was issued in one of the dino sets it's the same kind of setup with the hollow center with the crane in the middle we do have a working propeller you can spin that around and then we have the engine section there in the middle. We also have a winch with this. If I lift this up, you can see we have this working mechanism in the middle. If we turn that, you can lower down the cage section or you can bring it back up into the center. In the middle of there, we do have the ice block, which does contain the crystal element. If I disconnect that, you can have a look at the ice block. Most or all of these Arctic sets will come with one of these. It is a accessible piece with a crystal element inside which is a silver crystal piece which you can just put inside there because this is what the expedition is all about, finding these crystal element pieces. And we also have three studs in the middle of there so you can attach three different things if you need to do so and that will detach from the crane which is just a hook underneath which will attach to the top of there we have the landing gear which is the ski style landing gear because this does have to land on snow and in the front of the cockpit we can remove the front cockpit there with the minifigure pilot or the pilot and minifigure sitting in there with the control panel at the front and that will just clip back onto the front there we also have the rear tail propeller as well which will also spin but there you go there is the heli crane a very cool looking set with some really cool accessories also 
Well, thanks for dropping into this LEGO City Arctic review, and I hope to see you here next time on Toy Review TV. <laughs>